The journey of your cotton clothes. The cotton plant has been cultivated by humans for about 7,000 years. It grows in warm, sunny climates and requires large amounts of water. A seed takes about three months to mature into a full grown plant, at which point the fluffy white fibers are harvested, usually by machine, but sometimes by hand. The cotton is cleaned in a machine called a gin, which removes the seeds from the fiber. A different machine spins the raw cotton into threads, and these are woven into sheets on a loom. These sheets are known as grey goods in the cotton industry. The grey goods are transported to manufacturers that bleach, dye, or print patterns on the sheets of fabric. Other processes include making the cotton smoother, softer, flame retardant, or wrinkle resistant. Then, the processed fabric is sent to factories where it is cut and sewn into items of clothing, cleaned and pressed. Finished items of clothing are packed and sent from the factory to the warehouse. They are either distributed to retailers to sell in shops or posted directly to consumers who have made purchases online. A lot of work goes into the production of our clothes. A 2009 study concluded that just one t-shirt produced in India and sold in the UK required 2,650 litres of water, 10 kilograms of fertilizers, and half a kilogram of fossil fuels to go from cotton seed to closed store shelf. Clothing is a necessity and the industry provides many jobs, but we should still make sure we take care of our clothes and donate, repurpose or recycle them when we don't need them any longer.